Hi, I'm Diane Holmes, and I've been fortunate enough to grow up around horses my entire life. I grew up in Madison, Wisconsin on a ranch. I was fortunate to have, on my dad's side, rodeo background, and on my mom's side, gated horses. So it gave me a very diverse opportunity with horses. After college, I went on and pursued team roping in the PRCA. I qualified for the Great Lakes Circuit Final in the team roping. I still have that passion of barrel racing and team roping, but since then, I've now acquired a new discipline and I do cowboy mounted shooting. So my passion is working with children and adults and I'm a registered certified instructor with PATH International. You can see today I have a wide variety of horses here from small to large and I'm very excited to be able to demonstrate some of the new wall products that have come out. Who I've chosen today to clip with is Billy. He is an eight-year-old Shining Sparks AQHA horse. He's also my competitive mounted shooting horse. He does team roping also and team sorting. So today I'm going to clip the areas of the muzzle, the eyes, the ears, his bridle path underneath here and his legs down here and his fetlocks. I've chosen to clip Billy today with Wall's new Figuera. This new Figuera Pro Lithium Clipper as you can see, it's very contoured to fit comfortably in my hand. It is a powerful lithium ion battery. Benefits of lithium ion are more power, more torque, more charge cycles, no more memory effect. It was 6,000 strokes per minute, 90 minute cordless runtime, 10 minute charge time for five minute additional runtime. No more memory effect. Five in one fine blade. The five-in-one blade has the five featured settings of 9, 10, 15, 30, and 40. As you saw, it was easy for me to take the blade out, put the blade back in to adjust the blade settings. I turn this tab right here and it adjusts from a 40 all the way to a 9, 9 being the highest setting and 40 being the closest setting. I'm going to now take and set it at the 40 setting and I'm going to start working on his whiskers. I'm helping hold his face as a guide. And you see me change my hand position because it's much more comfortable to have the clipper held like this. It's steady, it's lightweight, it runs quiet, and it never gets hot, which is very important for any clipper as you're clipping, especially when you're in sensitive areas. I'm gonna go move up to his eyes. I'm not gonna go directly at his eyes. I'm also gonna use my other hand as a guide to protect his eyes and go across and just get the eyes, not the actual eyelashes, just the long whiskers part. If you want to and you feel comfortable, you can hold the clipper like this or like this. I like to hold it like this Place it here, go as a guide straight across. Come here, hold his face, protect the bottom eye, and come straight and get those. We are now going to go to his bridle path and his ears. And that's what's unique with this blade because I don't have to go get another clipper. I'm just gonna change my setting right here. Okay, I'm going to now prepare the bridle path for what I'd like to cut. So I'm gonna take the halter and separate the hair right here so I know that's my ending point. And I'm going to mark that with a little clip right there. I'm going to also mark in the front so I don't get any more of a forelock than I want to. Once I have that established, whether I go from this way or from his ears back, it's all the same. It's going to be one cut and there the hair comes straight off. I'm going to squeeze his ear lightly together, make one straight line down. Okay, I've now done his muzzle, his eyes, his bridle path, and his ears. So I'm going to prepare to do his jawline, and I'm going to remove all of this area. I'm going to set my clipper at the 30 setting. Once again, just using the easy tab here. Set it at 30, turn my clipper on. Okay, so I'm going to clip right along here. Once again, nice quiet clipper not getting hot in these sensitive areas.
I'm able to maneuver the clipper very easy in my hand with this nice contoured style. Still using the same setting. I know I've said this, but one thing is very nice that I've been able to do all these body parts and my clipper has not gotten hot. As you can see, with this wonderful power and torque, I'm not having any problems moving through the thickness or the coarse hair here. Getting this area nice and clean, either whether I was showing, but for myself, I'm going to be competing. So I'm cleaning up the area for his protective leg gear. And I'm moving the clipper around, blending it. And just to refresh, the areas I clipped were the muzzle, the eyes, the ears, the bridle path, and his fetlocks, all in the five-in-one blade settings from 9, 10, 15, 30, and 40. With this new Frigera, which is the Pro Lithium with more power, more torque, more charge cycles, no more memory effect, and taking the cordless technology to the next level. Hi, I'm Diane Holmes, and I've been fortunate enough to grow up around horses my entire life. I grew up in Madison, Wisconsin on a ranch. I was fortunate to have, on my dad's side, rodeo background, and on my mom's side, gated horses. So it gave me a very diverse opportunity with horses. After college, I went on and pursued team roping in the PRCA. I qualified for the Great Lakes Circuit Final in the team roping. I still have that passion of barrel racing and team roping, but since then, I've now acquired a new discipline and I do cowboy mounted shooting. My passion is working with 